Hey guys, Prince here from Army Project 529, and I am wrapping up our series of behind the scenes videos for FESTA, showing you guys how we bring the project and the blog to life each week for you. I'm here to show you how I write each week's Monday Muster blog. I wish I could show you dramatic footage of me writing with a quill pen wrapped in a lace shawl, sitting in front of a fireplace like a Bronte sister. But the reality is more me in front of my computer, watching all of the content Doc gives me in our spreadsheet, taking notes and snacking on my emotional support pieces. I start each week by reviewing the overall topic Normally, I'll have a theme in mind before I start, but sometimes that can change as I go through the content. I take a lot of notes as I watch so that I don't forget how everything makes me feel when I go to write about it. It may seem really tedious, but it's an important part of my process. Sometimes I even find myself getting bias right while I watch. Thanks, Jimin. Thank you so much. Depending on my theme for the week and time flow, sometimes I might mess around with the order uh, that Doc gives me the content in our spreadsheet, but not always. Eventually, all the links get moved into a document where I end up writing the blog. Big shout out and thank you to my wonderful volunteer editing assistant, Kendra, for all her help with that process. As I write, I'll come up with the bang 10 bubbles and the fun facts. Sometimes inspiration comes easier than others. A lot of times when I'm writing, I'll find myself getting in my feels. Chronicling this journey of BTSs is, is teaching me a lot about myself and how I relate to the world. There's no great secret or anything like that to how I write the blog. I just go with my gut. I go with how BTS makes me feel every week and what I think is the most important lesson to take away from the content that we're covering each time. Once I'm done with my word vomiting, Kendra sails back in again to proofread, and then the blog gets handed over to our amazing website volunteer, Colette, for formatting. Once Colette is done, myself and some members of the admin team will gather for what we call the final bulletproof reading. We'll double check everything, make any necessary changes that need to happen, and polish the blog up to send it out for its debut. Each week, I'm excited to see what our amazing team produces from start to finish. We might not be a well-oiled machine yet, but we are getting there for sure. That sentence, they took every opportunity to promote themselves that presented itself. Yeah. It feels awkward. Hold on. It is. It took every presented opportunity to promote themselves. Oh, I like that. That's better. Or every available opportunity. Yeah. I almost like available better. Yeah. 